Hello everyone and welcome to the introduction video on CBS skill subject on augmented and virtual reality developed by 1M1B Foundation in partnership with Meta India. My name is Anip Sharma and I am from 1M1B Foundation and I am here to walk you through the skill subject that we have come up with. What is extended reality? Why is it important? And why you as an educator and why should your students be taking up this skill subject? So first of all, let's think about why is extended reality important in today's world? You're looking at the video right now in a two-dimensional screen, right? And we understand that there is still a fundamental disconnect between the physical world we live in and the virtual world, the digital world that we interact with using our mobile phones and our computer. And this fundamental gap limits us from taking advantage of the billions of smart and intelligent interconnected devices that we have all over the world. And it also keeps us from realizing infinite possibilities in the virtual universe. So extended reality technologies helps us in bridging this gap and they can essentially transform the way how we learn things, how we make decisions and how we interact with our physical world also. Right. And then as the concept of metaverse as virtual technologies, augmented reality, virtual reality become a part of our daily lives. It is going to lead to a lot of opportunities also, which in turn is going to lead to a lot of new and very exciting jobs. So we, in the future, we are going to have jobs where people are going to be designing interactive games. Uh, people are going to be marketing specialists in metaverse, right? And then there will be jobs for AR, VR software designers also. So the point of introducing the skill subject right now is that how do we prepare our students to become a part of this interesting and very exciting change that is coming up and make sure that they are ready for, uh, for, for using this technology. And the reason of coming up with this skill subject right now is to prepare our students to become a part of this very exciting change that is coming up and to make sure that they are ready to be a part of the metaverse and they are ready to become creators of metaverse also. Now we have talked about what is the need of extended reality. So now let's also talk about what is the requirement of the skill subject of extended reality. So as you know, right, we have been uh, through this pandemic in the last couple of years and a lot of students of our country have already become a part of the virtual world. They have been attending virtual classes, they have been setting virtual backgrounds, they have been using filters on social media, on their uh, virtual meeting platforms. And because they are already acquainted with this virtual and augmented realities now, an XR skill subject, a skill subject in augmented and virtual reality will essentially help them in understanding the fundamental concepts of this technology, give them a jump start on using and developing this technology for their own uh, use and their own purpose and then also make them ready to shape the metaverse. Talking more about the skill subject on augmented and virtual reality, the learning objective of this whole subject is to develop a readiness in students for understanding, appreciating and becoming able to develop basic extended realities and also understand its applications in the modern world. Walking you through the salient features of the whole subject, the whole subject is divided into two modules which are 12 hours long each and they are suitable for students of grade 6 to 8. We have curated the whole subject in such a way that there is no prior knowledge that you will require to become a part of this subject or to take this subject up. So even a novice learner who does not have any idea what augmented reality is or what virtual reality is can still take this subject up and complete it successfully. To make the course interesting, we have also included a lot of experiential project based and activity based learning and we have tried to keep the theory content to a minimum. For the teachers out there to make it easier for them to facilitate this course, we have come up with comprehensive learning material where we have student handbooks, we have teacher handbooks and we have classroom materials that you can use in your classes to conduct sessions on augmented and virtual reality with your students and engage them in this very fun uh, discussion. Last but not the least, you don't require any exclusive, any state of the art hardware to become a part of this course, right? So one of the limitations that people usually talk about when, they, uh, when we discuss augmented and virtual reality 
is that you will need this hi-fi softwares and hardwares to experience these technologies but we have made sure that we create a course where all the experiments all the activities that we have put can be completed using a basic smartphone and a laptop coming to the subject curriculum as i mentioned the whole curriculum is divided into two modules each module is 12 hours long and as i mentioned again these modules are suitable for grade 6 to 8 students but again we will leave it up to the facilitators to take it to maybe uh, students of grade 4 and 5 also or to take it to the uh, secondary schools and their senior students as well so walking you through the curriculum of the whole subject now module 1 essentially talks about the softer aspects of understanding and appreciating ar and vr where we start with first of all demystifying extended reality so we try to understand what is this technology all about what is the hype all about and why suddenly everybody is so excited about this so we try to understand what is extended reality and what is it not taking one step forward we try to understand extended reality in a much more deeper way and we try to see that it has three parts to it right so we try to differentiate between augmented realities virtual realities and mixed realities so that when we are interacting with these technologies we are able to identify which part of extended reality are we actually engaging with we move on and we start experiencing these technologies these extended realities using our mobile phones using our computer so we have a lot of fun experiments experiences around ar around vr included in the subject for you and your students then we also talk about xr applications in different sectors in our life right so we talk about how is ar vr being used in healthcare how is it being used in education what are the different applications in the field of retail and so on right and especially if we talk about students we have a lot of applications experiences in the field of entertainment and gaming also right and then the first module concludes with a discussion on how do we use these reality technologies for social good so we take our students through a discussion on sdgs and then we also discuss few case studies with them on in how to use xr to push and propel these sdgs forward moving on to module 2 which is more about the hard skills right how do you create these reality technologies yourself so the first lesson in uh, module 2 is about understanding the workflow of xr so if i want to develop an extended reality solution an ar application let's say what is the process that i can follow so we walk you through that process then we dive deeper uh, into that process using design thinking so how do we come up with innovations how do we identify problems around ourselves and how do we make sure that we know the process that can lead us to a solution that actually works using these xr technologies that we're talking about moving on we start getting our hands dirty and we talk about marker based xrs we talk to our students about how do we actually create these markers which can trigger these augmented reality and extended reality setups then we have a lesson on designing 2d and 3d graphics which can become a part of our virtual universe and then we conclude module 2 with the discussion on a three hour long project on creating our own augmented reality setup so by the time your students will be through this whole program they will be able to understand what these reality technologies are all about where are they being used uh, right now around us what can be the possible applications of these technologies in the future and then if i have a problem that i have identified if i want to create a solution if i want to create my own xr application how do i do that let us also give you a glimpse of the learning material that we have curated for all of you and what it looks like so you can see in the student handbook that we have used a lot of bright colors we have used graphics and it is all very aesthetically pleasing when students look at it so we have tried to break the monotony and we have tried to make it interesting and appealing for the kids all the resource and reference material that we are going to be using for our experiments activities and experiences are also hyperlinked in the books using the web links and the qr codes so that all of you can access it easily and to facilitate our students taking notes making pointers and noting down what strikes a chord with them we have also provided places in between these handbooks for them to take notes 
If you take a look at the teacher handbooks, it follows a very similar layout as the student handbooks, but it also includes note, prompts and ideas on how to start discussions with your students in your classrooms. The teacher handbook also includes the slide numbers corresponding to the classroom's material deck that we have prepared for all of you. And if you look at the experiences and activities that we have included, we have also put a reference time duration for each of the activities so that it is easier for the educators to pace their classes when they are engaging students in the skill subject. And now you can also take a look at some of the screenshots of the classroom learning material, the presentation decks that we have created for all of you so that you can go to this uh, CBSE website where all this learning material is already hosted, download the content from there, make sure that you are familiar and acquainted with it and start engaging your students on this very exciting skill subject on AR and VR.